Hey y'all, welcome back to Lil Cricket Crafts. I am back again today and happy Valentine's Day. I hope your day is full of love and appreciation because I know my morning started off that way. I woke up to wonderful gifts from my boyfriend and I was wearing this amazing sweater he bought me that I've been wanting forever, but I had to work out because tonight is pizza night and gotta have that balance. So I had to work out so I can eat the pizza tonight. I have not had pizza in forever, y'all. I'm pumped. Okay, so let's get to the point, right? You're probably wondering, what are we crafting today? If you're here on my channel. So today I'm actually just going to wing it. I mean, I do that most of the time anyways, but we're really gonna wing it today. So I was painting these popsicle sticks. Guess what? That I got from the Dollar Tree. I was painting them last night and I painted them the steel, um, Waverly chalk paint steel color. It's right here. Um, here is the Waverly. Remember, I made a mess if you saw my last video. Um, it's the Waverly steel. Got it from Walmart. It was only like seven or eight. I mean, six or seven dollars for this big thing eight fluid ounces and so I painted I don't even know how many I painted but I was like oh maybe I'll think of something that I can do with these and I have thought of something I don't know if it's gonna be great but I thought of something so I have these boxes from the Home Depot that I got a long time ago because I thought I was going to need them, but they ended up being way too big for what I needed them for. And they've just been under our bed for months, months. And so what can I do with this, with some popsicle sticks, with some spray paint? Mm. So my little creative mind started thinking, I am going to cut out like the center of this box and then use the inside that's plain. I am going to spray paint it teal. Um, I have this really pretty um, teal spray paint that I'm going to do. Teal, I shouldn't say teal. It's more turquoise. Um, I like, cause it's not as green, it's more light blue. So that's turquoise, I think. And so I'm gonna cut that out. I'm gonna spray paint this turquoise. And then I'm going to outline the turquoise with these, kind of making like my own picture frame, but it's gonna be made out of cardboard and popsicle sticks, y'all. And then once I have my teal center and my steel um, frame, I am going to make a decal with my Cricut to put in there and probably put it in our bedroom because our Living room, I'm pretty much done decorating the walls and trying to keep it simple. Um, and our bedroom actually has a turquoise theme. So that is what we're doing today. So let's get started. but this um, I did it uneven so of course the cardboard is showing through a little bit and there's like darker teal spots than others but I kind of liked it this way because I'm going for that distressed look all throughout my house as you know I liked that it looked um, distressed already just by barely doing a couple coats over it because you know the cardboard's soaking it in so it needs more coats than normal but if we're trying to get the distress look, just throw it on there. That's the best part about distress. Throw it on there, it doesn't have to be perfect. So next step is I'm going to take all of my popsicle sticks and I'm going to keep lining them up around the edges as I go so I know um, how many I need, how, how I need to cut them. But I'm gonna cut the ends off like this to make them a complete rectangle instead of 
the curved edges so that we're lining up all around to make that frame on this cardboard. So let's get cutting. ended up painting over the steel Waverly chalk paint with my Waverly elephant color so it made it the darker gray and then I went over like you saw and I actually sanded it distressing is my thing right now y'all like that's all I want to do is make stuff distressed so um, here it is and now I just have to figure out where I'm gonna put it and then I can figure out what I actually want to put on it so it'll go kind of hand in hand. So let me think on that and then we'll be right back. perfect it's my first try and it was just something to do with these popsicle sticks I wanted to paint at like midnight last night which is like a record bedtime for me by the way um, total granny status sad excuse for a 24 year old right but that's okay um so here it is I put hello sweet cheeks because I'm going to actually put this in our guest bathroom I think over the toilet so hello sweet cheeks um, just something cute somewhere to put it for now um, I decided to do this sweet, a little um, diagonal, made it kind of cute. And so you can do whatever you want with these. You can use whatever colors you want. Um, you can do them better. You can get the longer sticks, like maybe paint sticks from um, the Home Depot, anything. Um, stay tuned for my next craft because as soon as I get my wood stain, when this freeze lets me go back to get more wood stain, um, I'm going to create a box, a decorative box out of Home Depot um, paint sticks. So I'm super excited about that. So stay tuned. But um, thank you for joining me for this cute little craft. Um, it took a while. Obviously I've had like five outfit changes because workout, chill, everything. And so here we are, um, like nine o'clock. That's okay, that's what crafting's about. You do it in the comfort of your home. Okay, so. Um, thank you for watching, and if you liked it, hit like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you do not miss my next craft because it's going to be cute, and I can't wait to share it with you guys. So without further ado, I will see you in my next video.